what is going on everybody it is zdb shoes back for yet another video today and today i'm going to be talking a little bit about back to school and what kind of shoes you guys might want to be grabbing to go back to school and mainly the theme that i'm going to be focusing on is a single pair of shoes that you can buy and it's going to last you the whole year and probably even longer than that because i know a lot of you guys might Every single year you might get one pair of shoes and that's your one pair of shoes for the year. I know that's the way it used to be for me or at least, you know, when I was in middle school and elementary school or whatever, my parents would buy me one pair of shoes and if I wanted more, I'd have to go, you know, make money myself and buy those shoes on my own. And I know a lot of you guys, if you're watching this video, you probably do that. But if you're looking for that one pair of shoes that's gonna last you all year that your parents are gonna buy you or that you're gonna buy yourself or whatever, I'm gonna give you 10 solid shoes that you'll definitely be able to rock all year long and look good. All right guys, so let's go ahead and jump into it. So the first one, and if you don't have this shoe, then you're out of sneaker head. No, I'm kidding guys. Just everyone has a shoe. A lot of people have these shoes and they last forever and they're amazing so nike air force ones not too much to be said about these guys they've been around forever they're nike's cash cow you can pick them up for 90 bucks they've been at that price point forever pretty good pickup for a shoe that's going to last forever i know a lot of people uh, might be in the comments saying that, that oh no dude i buy a new pair of air force ones every week because the toes crease up that's not something that i care about especially when I was in school in middle school and high school I would rock a pair you know I had a pair of Vans that I rocked for years and I actually still wear them today I, I don't really care about the wear and tear anyway guys that's the first shoe on the list you can't go wrong with a pair of forces they always look great they go with basically any outfit and they're definitely gonna last you all year all right moving on to number two it's gonna be the Adidas Ultra Boost now, these come in a variety of colorways and a variety of different models. My favorite types are the Ultra Boost 1.0 to the 4.0. They just released their 2019 line of Ultra Boost. They kind of reimagined the look of the shoe. I like to stick to the 1.0 through 4.0, like I just mentioned previously. It's just a real classic silhouette and a, a silhouette that Adidas invented that seem to catch on kind of with the NMDs and everything else and a lot of other shoe companies followed. So these are like some of the most comfortable shoes you can find. They definitely will last you all year. You can pick most of them up for around 160, but I've seen them on sale for under a hundred bucks on finish line champs occasionally. It depends on the colorways. A lot of colorways are more popular than others. You just have to pick the right colorway. You might get one for, you know, 80 to 90 bucks but that is the second shoe. Now moving on to the third shoe, that's gonna be the Stan Smith Adidas Originals. And I can't really you know, stress enough how these shoes last forever. They're super versatile. You can wear them with socks, without socks. You can do anything in these shoes. They're so simple and plain. They come in a bunch of different colorways, but um, you know, the only thing changing is basically gonna be a heel top back there, like. The pair I have is, is the green pair. You can get them in blue, red, straight up white, all white, you know, whatever you wanna do. Super versatile pair of shoes though. You can wear them with jeans, shorts, socks, no socks like I was mentioning earlier. But, um, and these are very affordable. Retail for 80 bucks, but I've seen them on sale plenty of places. I think I saw them on sale on Finish Line for like 63 bucks the other day. Really affordable shoe. I would definitely pick it up if you could. And yeah, really quality leather. It's gonna last forever. Definitely pick up some Stan Smiths, guys. So next, moving on to a shoe that is probably kinda, I might get some hate for. I know a lot of people don't like this shoe. They have been constantly put on sale at finish line. And I love the shoe. I don't know why other people don't like them, but I'm putting it on the list because these are straight beaters. They'll last you forever. And they, in my opinion, look good and they fit the dad shoe model. So that's the Champion 9318. 
and they do kind of remind me of the Puma RSX that they just released, but you can get these for a lot cheaper than the Puma RSX. You find them on sale. I saw them the other day for 65 bucks. I got my pair for 55 in store at a finish line. So um, if you want these, maybe go locally to your local chance or finish line and see if they have any sales on these. They might have some in store that they're trying to get rid of. And they're super comfortable, almost as comfortable as my Ultra Boost, I would say. I know that's surprising. Um, but they have that chunky dad, almost a wave runner look. And that's what I like about them. But anyway, moving on to our next shoe. And that is the Jordan 1 Phantom Gym Red colorway. Now the reason I picked this shoe is that obviously everybody loves Jordan 1s. This shoe is a little bit more on the affordable side as far as Jordan 1s go. So you can pick these up for around 130 in some sizes if you wear if you have a bigger foot. If you have a smaller foot, it goes about up to 190. I know that might be out of some of you guys' price range, but it's still cheap for a Jordan 1. So if you really want a Jordan 1, maybe check out this colorway. And as everybody says, Jordan 1s just, they, they look great no matter how much you wear them. A lot of people wear Jordan 1s as beaters because they're just made to wear out. Like they look great, they're made with great leather and they're one of the most classic silhouettes ever and they never get old. So great shoe, definitely recommend looking at the Phantom Gym Red colorway. So next, moving on to our, what is this, our seventh shoe? Yeah, our seventh shoe, the Nike Air Vapor Max. And I have no preference on, you know, you have your Vapor Max ones, twos, threes, fours, the picture that I've chosen to put up here though is the 2019 and that is my favorite model of the Vapor Max. Now Vapor Maxes are also on the higher end. I think they retail for around 190. I have seen them on sale a ton though. Champs, Finish Line, you know, Foot Locker, Foot Action, even famous footwear for some of these places. Anyway guys, amazing shoe. They're really comfortable. They've been really popular this year and I think they're only gonna get more popular. They're gonna last a long time because you know you've got the airbags on the bottom or the air, what do people call them? The air units on the bottom for that really cushiony feel. Definitely gonna last you a really long time and well worth your money. Okay guys, so our next shoe, super classic silhouette, rather cheap model of shoe, cheaper than a lot of these on the list and that is the Adidas Continental 80. These are kind of in line with the Sam Smith on the price point of $80, but you find them on sale constantly. I know I'm saying this about a lot of the shoes, but a lot of them do go on sale. So Continental 80s, like I said, retail for 80 bucks, but you can find some colorways for as low as $30. Um, now, obviously those are the least popular colorways because they're trying to sell them. But if you're looking for a budget shoe and you don't really care about the color, maybe look at the Continental 80s. If you like the white or the black and you don't mind spending 80 bucks, grab a pair. They're a good beater pair. I know Harrison Neville, he always mentions he wears his Continentals to wash his car in or just to wear around all the time as beaters because they last so long and they still look good. So definitely a good pair of shoes to wear to school. All right guys, so on to the next pair, which is the Air Max 97. And this is a classic Nike shoe. Have a bunch of classic colorways. You can go any way you want to with these shoes. They're always gonna look good. They're always gonna feel good. And like I said, they're going to be good beaters, gonna last you forever. And these usually come in at around 160 to 170. So on the higher end as well, but you can also find, you know, the least popular colorways will be cheaper or will go on sale from time to time. I recently picked up a pair of Air Max 97 QS Metallic Golds for like 85 bucks. And that's a huge deal for an Air Max 97. It just being a least, a less popular colorway made it easier for me to get those for a little bit cheaper. Okay, so our 10th and final shoe is gonna be 
probably the most affordable shoe on this list and probably the most popular shoe on this list in terms of how many people wear this shoe and that is the Vans Old School the core or whatever you want to call it Vans Old School these usually come in at $55 depending on what colorway you get but you're not gonna pay for more than like 70 to 80 bucks on some of the more extravagant colorways you know one of the more classic colorways is just the straight up black or you can get the black with the checkerboard recently a more popular colorway that's come out has been the yacht club colorway with the blue green yellow and red i think are the colors that come on that super cheap you're never gonna pay over like 70 to 80 bucks for these and like I mentioned earlier in the video guys, Vans last forever. I am 24 years old now. I have a pair of Vans that I bought when I was, I think 18, that I still wear today. Um, now they are starting to wear holes in the soles, but I still wear them guys, because they're just, you know, they still look okay. And they haven't really ripped or anything like that. Like I said, they do have holes, but. But yeah guys, they last forever. They're an amazing shoe. They look good with anything. They're kind of like the Stan Smiths. You can wear them with socks, without socks, with jeans, with shorts, with swimsuit, whatever you want to do, guys. That wraps up the sneaker list, but I did want to throw in one final thing that everybody needs to have for going back to school, you know, on a maybe on a day that you don't feel like throwing on some sneakers, you have a, you don't have much time to get out the door or maybe for just relaxing after school. And that is the Adidas Adelette Cloud Foam Slides. So these are an essential for basically anyone guys. Like I don't really know anyone who doesn't have a pair of slides or at least a pair of flip flops. And slides are really in right now. And if you want a pair of slides, you can't go wrong with getting these Adidas slides. I've seen them go for as low as 10 bucks on adidas.com. Complete steal, guys. Like, like you can wear these when you go take the trash out or when you go to, to do other things, when you go to mow the lawn, whatever you wanna do in these, guys. Super comfortable. They feel like cloud foam, as is in the name. And like I said, guys, if you don't have much time to get ready in the morning, just slip on those slides and go to go to school. So, but anyway, guys, I will wrap it up there. I know I've gone on a little bit long. Um, let me know what you thought about this list and let me know if you're going to be buying any of these shoes that I recommended. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know if you want to see another list, another themed list like this, and I'll put together another list. But other than that, guys, I'll see you soon. Peace. Mm -hmm.